Hello Common Ground congregations around the city. My name is Ryan and I have the privilege of being on the leadership team at the Rondebosch AM congregation. And I've also had the privilege of the last 10 years of spearheading our collective congregational efforts in serving the nation of Madagascar. Currently, we send about six different teams a year to serve that nation, the people, the churches in that nation with the gospel. Why am I telling you all of that today? Well, because I'm really excited to announce that we, Common Ground, are sending of our very best to plant a church in Madagascar, right in the heart of the capital city, Antananarivo. I'm going to ask Blake to tell us a little bit more about the passion and excitement that's growing in his heart and in his wife Rachel's heart and in the hearts of their three young kids all under the age of six. Here's Blake. Hi everyone, I'm Blake and I'm married to Rachel and we have these three young kids that Ryan's just referred to. We've been amazed at how God has sovereignly weaved our lives into this story over the last couple of years. Rachel and I have got such a passion for missions and for Africa. We actually met on the mission field. Rachel was born on the mission field and spent many years there. And since then, over the last 10 years of marriage, we've been asking ourselves, why has God put these passions in us? And not only that, but how does it relate to the larger Common Ground story? Well, this church plant in Antananarivo is an answer to that prayer and to that question. Since this idea came about, the small spark that was initially in our heart has become a roaring flame. We are so excited for the adventure that lies ahead. So we would love you to stand in prayer with us in four ways. The reality is we're packing up our house currently and we fly out at the end of July. And the idea is that we spend the first six months getting to know this new culture and this new country. And uh, we'd love you to pray that during that time, God helps us discern where it is that He wants us to plant in the capital city of Antananarivo. Not only that, but He would add amazing people from the Malagasy context to us to support us and to enjoy this God adventure with us. Thirdly, we're trying our level best to lead our family through this transition. So we would love your prayers in how to lead our little kids and lead our family as we go into this new culture. And lastly, language. We're going into a country that speaks Malagasy and secondly French and only third English. And so we'd love you to pray with us that we would learn the language quickly and that God would use that for, to develop a connection between us and the people and allow us to serve them swiftly. Wow, what an exciting gospel opportunity and adventure. We would love to ask you, Common Ground, to stand with the Tuckers as they go. We'd love to ask you to pray for them along the lines of what Blake has just been speaking about. We'd like to ask you to consider yourself. Are you the kind of individual or family who could possibly sow a few months, possibly even a few years of your life to go be a part of a missional core and planting a church in that nation? And thirdly, we would love to get behind the Tuckers financially. We'd love to see them going with everything they need to focus on serving that context missionally and starting and planting a church there. So if you would like to give, we'd like to invite you to use your normal Common Ground banking details that are on the website if you don't have them and use this giving reference, MDG Tuck, to get behind these guys and see them resourced for this mission that God's called them to. Common Ground Church, we are so excited about God stirring us and sending us. And we want to get right behind the Tucker family as they go on behalf of us, Common Ground, and more importantly, on behalf of Christ, the head of the church, to serve this great city. Thank you so much for standing with us as we do this.